Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be talking about that company, Wayfair. So a lot of things are going on. A lot of people are saying that those people are probably doing human, human trafficking because if you go to their site, they have these cabinets that are like $10,000 or more. Not only that, those cabinets are named after missing children. So they're, you know, those, that company also, you know, they're combined with, you know, they have products on Amazon, Etsy, and everything. And a lot of people have been doing, you know, research and everything. And, you know, they just find it so weird that these listings, they have names of children that have gone missing. And then it says, like, the weight like of a person on the listing but obviously if you do a purchase you're not going to receive the actual person you know in a box so the way that there's you know trafficking children they're trying to do it in a slick way but it but everything has came out to light and you can see all this like you know on the internet they're selling pillows that cost like $10,000 with children's name on it. They're also selling um paintings of, you know, paintings supposedly that a child made, you know, with the price of $10,000 and everything. Now, who will buy a cabinet that looks so ordinary and boring for $10,000? Because all these cabinets, they all look the same. The only thing is that the names that they're giving these cabinets, which are names of missing children, are different. But these cabinets are looking the same. Now, the company Wayfair, they said that they have nothing to do with human trafficking. And that the reason, you know, they're, these cabinets or, you know, some of their products cost $10,000 or more is because they're high quality so since all this was going on on the internet and also with social media people like sharing all this they removed all those listings and said that they're going to put a proper description of the item and why it costs you know that amount so people can know i don't know i just find that very suspicious you know, but if you take a picture, I mean, if you take a look at all these pictures, you know, I'm showing, you know, that kind of shows something is going on. I don't know. So that that's what's been going on, you know, you know, that's what's surface about Wayfair and all that. For the people who don't know what Wayfair is, you know, it's a, it's like a furniture store and they sell other items. So... The thing is that these cabinets, you know, that they have list listed in their site and everything, they're named after missing girls that are from all over. Now, human trafficking has been going on, you know, for years. Every day, a bunch of children go missing. So this is this is something very serious. You know, this this conspiracy theory about Wayfair started in in reddit somebody you know they were talking about it and showing proof and also in tiktok so that's that's mostly what's been going on with the wayfair you know theory and what everybody is sharing on the internet but thank you for watching like share and subscribe bye